All right, y'all. <laughs> this is the funniest thing I've seen in a long time. <laughs> the last cooking show, we were making chocolate chip cookies. And I was talking to you as I stirred it together. It's like, this is so runny. I don't know what's wrong with the recipe because we were going by the recipe. And we'll stick it in the fridge is what I told you. <laughs> After you left my kitchen, I turned around and you know what I found? gracious <laughs> about died when I turn around I'm like they're gone and I let the flower out no wonder it's runny <laughs> oh y'all let's add this flower <laughs> see if we can make these chocolate chips look right <laughs> oh y'all I'm just gonna add some at a time so I make sure I get it stirred up really good. <laughs> it doesn't matter. <laughs> oh, me. Oh, here we go, y'all. <laughs> it's looking better already. <laughs> oh, that is too funny. That is too stinking funny. Woo. Man, look at that already looking better. <laughs> Be sure you scrape your sides and your bottom. <laughs> I can't believe it. I wish y'all could have seen the look on my face when I turned around after saying goodbye to you. <laughs> I found the chocolate chips. It's too fun. I mean, found the pattern. <laughs> the flower. Oh, y'all. I'm telling you, got some problems around here. <laughs> I'm not talking too much about Jesus, I guess. Oh, that happens every once in a while. That's too funny. Look how, pre how pretty that's looking. I guess Cardelli chocolate does know what they're talking about. giggle about that off and on for the rest of today. Look, y'all. Isn't that looking pretty? Scrape the sides good. And scrape the bottom good. Look at that. Isn't that much better? I mean, that is exactly the way it's supposed to look. <laughs> exactly. Oh, my goodness. I bet every one of y'all <laughs> were hollering, don't turn it off yet. Wait your flowers behind you, woman. <laughs> oh, that's funny. I don't know how I'll put this. <laughs> Get these two videos on the same show. I don't know. Oh. All right. <laughs> there you go. My oven is preheated to 375. And <laughs> all you gotta do is take your cookie sheet out. Let's find one. <coughs> Excuse me. Again. Someday made my coffee clear. I guess it's some kind of allergy or something. Whew. All right. Here's my cookie sheet. And you know what I do sometimes? You can try it or not try it. Sometimes for some, I will put my cookie sheet in the oven, just empty for a few minutes. Let it get hot and then I'll take it out and put my cookies on there. Sometimes it just does better for me and I don't know why. Mine is not to ask why. Mine is just to do or die. <laughs> but, whew, we'll try it without again this time. 
first time. And it says to cook them um, nine to 11 minutes. And like I said, especially the first time you do things, your uh, oven, everybody's oven heats differently. Sometimes your oven will change. You just gotta watch, kind of watch stuff like that. <clears throat> but I will set it for eight. I don't want to burn. And then I'll peek. And then if they need to cook another minute or two. But really watch the first time. For sure. I watch every time. Because who knows what I'm, I'm going to do. <laughs> when you're dipping them out, try to get them about the same size. That'll have a difference in the way it cooks. <clears throat> and you know... <clears throat> with just me and Michael, unless I have plans for extra cookies, which, you know, a lot of times I'll fix some and get them to the grandkids that live close by or whatever. But I will, um, instead of cooking them all, because Michael and I, when we have, like, homemade cookies of whatever kind, <clears throat> we like to um, eat them warm. And so right after... <clears throat> um, dinner and we're done eating I'll turn the oven on before <clears throat> while we're eating and warm it up and then after we get done eating and everything I will stick them in stick us a few in there and then I'll just leave this dough cookie dough in the fridge I'll cover it up <clears throat> with some foil or some plastic wrap or whatever you want to use maybe you have a lid and maybe you just want to eat raw um, but and then it'll sit in my fridge all you know till we're done I'll like fix four or six a day <clears throat> and um or just whenever we want them and I'll leave it in there so it'll sit in there for several days until we're eating it all so, and me, because I don't want to wash an extra dish, I'll be putting this in there unless I need to use it. <clears throat> I won't be putting it in another dish and all that crap. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put these in for eight minutes, peek on them, <clears throat> and see if they need to cook another minute or two and go from there. Now, when you get them out of the oven, you can do... Uh, one or two things. When you get your pie pan or your cake, your cookie sheet out of the oven, <clears throat> it's hot, obviously. I come over here and I'll set it on my stove top and, um, or sit on your hot pads on your counter or whatever. And if you feel like they might need to cook just a little bit, but you don't want to really cook them in the, finish them in the oven because they're getting too brown, you can let them sit <clears throat> on the cookie sheet for, on the cookie sheet for a while. And that will cook them a little more just simply because it's still hot. Um, or if you think they are done, then you can go ahead and get your spatula and get them off immediately. Or they will get too uh, brown on the bottom. So it's just kind of like how you guys like to eat them. But just know <clears throat> if you leave them on your cookie sheet after you take them out, they will continue cooking for a little while. Uh, so that's just a heads up for you okay well geez that was that was quite interesting that was <laughs> I'm not quite sure how I'll get how I will get this on there and I'll probably just put it on two different things <clears throat> but I do love you as always, I'm glad you're in my kitchen, and I'm glad you joined me for our little cooking adventures. And um, it's a lot of fun, lots of laughs. Oh, and you guys are just so sweet. So I told you I was gonna put it on uh, eventually here in the next few days when I figure it out uh, on YouTube. <clears throat> and once I do that, I'll let you know how you can look it up on YouTube and uh, 
we can go from there. But I will continue putting it on Facebook, so you don't have to go to YouTube. But you can let friends know or whatever uh, that it is there. And we'll just see what the Lord does with it. He may say, well, I'm not going to do anything with that. <laughs> and that'll be just fine. <laughs> oh, my goodness, y'all. I want you to have a good day. I want you to have a lot of fun and keep cooking, okay? All right. Love you. Bye. Sorry, I forgot the flower. <laughs> oh, man.